Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we are going to make two types of crepe paper leaves and they are very easy to match with different flowers. In flower arrangement, leaves play a very important role in foiling the flowers and creating harmony. This is my wedding wreath with a magnolia theme. I have used blue and green leaves to set off the white magnolias so my flowers do not merge into the wall. And today I'm going to show you how to make these leaves. Before we start, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more art and craft tutorials. To start, we need crepe paper in blue and green colors, floral wire in 26 and 18 gauge, floral tape in light brown and dark green colors, a wire cutter, scissors, Yuhu glue and a paper clip as well. First of all, wrap the 18 gauge wire in light brown and dark green color. We need one of each. Take out our templates. Trim the paper about 5 cm in height and 20 cm in width. Give it a little stretch. In order to mimic the grains of the real leaves, we need to place the template diagonally to the grain. So the template is not placed following the grain of the paper. Fold the paper to the length of the rounded template and use a paper clip to hold it down on the curved side. And also put another paper clip on the other side as well. Cut the paper in the middle. Remember to leave about 2mm small gap as a seam line. Move the template a little to ensure that 2cm seam line is still there. Then use a paper clip to hold the paper down in the middle. Cut the shape of the leaves according to the template. And do the same to the other half. Repeat this process until you have obtained 22 pieces of these half leaves. Now we do the same with the green leaves with a different template, which is a bit slimmer and longer. You will also need 22 pieces of these half leaves. Take out the dark green wire and it is going to be placed on the seam line in between two of the green leaves. Place the yuhu glue to two of the leaves and press the middle down so the paper is wrapped around the wire. When you construct the leaves, make sure the grain of the leaves are showing a V shape and the tip is pointing at you, which is the bottom. Cut the 26 gauge wire into 9 to 10 cm as the stem of the leaves. And also attach the wire and the leaves together. If you can't control the amount of glue you are squeezing, you can squeeze the glue bit by bit onto a paper first, so the paper will not soak with glue. Do exactly the same with the blue leaves. You will also need the 26 gauge wire in 9 to 10 cm as the stem of the leaves. Repeat these steps until you have made 11 leaves for each color. Trim the shape of the leaves. Then we start to construct with the green leaves first. Bend the wire to the tip of the green leaves. 
and place the first leaf about 1.5 cm below the main stem. Hold it tight and use floral tape to wrap it onto the main stem. Place the second leaf right next to it, so they are symmetrical. Wrap the tape a few more rounds, then attach the next set of leaves. You can leave about 2 to 2.5 cm space in between each sets. Then your first branch of green leaves is finished. Now we move on to the blues. Trim the leaves as well, but this time we will need to wrap the stem of each leaves with a light brown tape. When you wrap the leaves to the main stem, make sure you leave a bit of stem out. So the first set, you leave about 1.5 cm. Second set, about 2 cm. The third one, about 3 cm. But then on the fourth one, go back down to 2 cm. And the fifth one will be with 1 cm and you use the same method to cure all the leaves. Then your blue branch is done. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, please like, comment and subscribe to our channel and follow us on our Instagram. We will upload more exciting tutorials very soon. We are offering free templates for these leaves. Feel free to check our information box below for more details.